Are you salty? You heard me right. Are you salty? Jesus said we should be. Listen to what he said. You are the salt of the earth, but if the salt loses its flavor, how shall it be seasoned? It is then good for nothing but to be thrown out and trampled underfoot by men. One of the many vital functions of salt is that it makes us thirsty. And the water we drink in response to thirst balances out sodium levels in our blood. It's an important biological fact. And while first century followers wouldn't have known the physiology behind salt, it still worked the same way. They still experienced the sensation of being thirsty after eating salty dishes, and they needed a healthy dose of water to balance things out. As followers of Jesus, we should take a cue from this today. Just as our brain creates a desire for water when we ingest salt, our lives, when observed by the people around us, should create a desire for the living water of Jesus Christ. Does your life make people thirsty for Jesus? Does what they see in you model for them the love, peace, and grace that comes with a life devoted to Him? Let me challenge you today to live a life worthy of following. To the best of your ability, imitate Jesus. Be the salt in your world that creates a thirst for Jesus Christ.